Hi guys, how are you doing? Um, many Git players ask me to uh, explain a little bit about my playing concepts in jazz. And um, I thought, well, there are some chord progressions that are very important, like the 2-5-1 in minor and the 2-5-1 in major. So I would like to compare those to uh, see what ideas we could get out of that. And um, let's say you have a 2-5-1 in D minor, which is a E half diminished chord, going to a, a A seventh flat 13, D minor 9, sometimes I'll add a 6 there as well, nice chord, and let's say I'm uh, playing type of sound. Um, now what I do is uh, the D minor chord has a relative major chord. It's very important to know that. So you go up a minor third from the root, which is an F, and you've got the relative major chord, F major 7. And then I look up the 2-5-1 of that key, of the, of the major key. So that would be G minor 7, C7, F major 7. So there is a great thing going on between the 2 5 1 here and this 2 5 1 going here. Because they're strongly related to each other. Um, the thing is that when I'm playing a half diminished chord, uh, that would be the same as a G minor 6 chord, you know. This is an E minor uh, 7 flat 5, put under the G bass, and you got a G minor 6. So there is a strong relationship between those two chords. And uh, so I could just play a G minor 7 over that chord and it would sound very good. Uh, then playing the F over this chord would create a nice altered sound because uh, let's say you've got the A, B flat, C, the B flat and the C are the flat 9 and the raised 9 and you got a flat 13 as well. So nice altered uh, sound over the A chord, eh? and then resolving to the D minor 7, and I could also, instead of this chord, well, playing this uh, arpeggio, I could substitute that for F major 7 arpeggio. So let's um, play it. That I'm, I, I think I sneaked in one um, diminished run there. But uh, most of the things I was playing here was um, the 2 5 1 in the major, unaltered. So, because uh, thinking in that uh, C chord would be altered in the uh, A chord, you know, because you're playing the, those altered notes B flat, C, and the F against the A7 chord. So, that's uh, one way of playing uh, relatively simple over this progression. Now, I'll discuss something else. 